And we're back with another reminder from your neighborhood conspiracy theorist. In March of 2009, the Obama administration offered a $535 million loan to the solar panel company Solyndra. This government loan into a private company was never paid back. Along with hundreds of millions of dollars of private investor money and the $535 million loan from the U.S. taxpayer, it took less than two years for this company to go completely bankrupt. The money was supposedly to be used to build a high-grade factory that would make solar panels that had state-of-the-art technology and was highly publicized by Barack Obama in his visit six months before the 2010 midterm selections. Just under two years after that federal loan guarantee, the Department of Energy restructured the loan of this company so that in the event that the company went under, the private investors would be paid back first and not the government, a.k.a. you, the taxpayer. Six months after that renegotiation, the company went bankrupt, costing the American citizen over $500 million. This company was supposed to create our green energy future and also, of course, create thousands of good, hard American jobs. And the federal loan guarantee program for good green jobs still exists to this day. That's just one company that lost over half a billion dollars right before the midterm. Green. Clean energy future. Sounds familiar. Just good, clean, green jobs. Good jobs.